Good morning, happy Vlogmas day 16. Max and I just went on a walk. Max never comes with me on my walks, but he came today, it was fun. It was pretty cold. It is Wednesday morning. I have a ton of work to do today. I heard someone call this the other day a heads down work day. That's like what I feel like I have today. I am uh, feeling like I have a lot to do, but I keep saying that because every day I have a lot to do. Um, but anyway, it's gonna be a fun day. I already put on this sweater set I got from Target yesterday. I'll show you guys in the mirror. I'm gonna get ready. And also, I want to tell you guys, I forgot to tell you guys this last couple days, I've been using these St. Tropez um, face tanning face tanning spray, bronzing water, face mist. Anyway, I really like it, but that's why I look kind of tan. I obviously haven't been anywhere, I'm just kind of tan. But this morning I've been feeling, I was feeling kind of uninspired, and then we went for a walk, and shockingly that made me feel more inspired, and I saw a few TikTok videos. Um, I was telling my hairdresser this yesterday that I was like, I get that a lot of people don't like social media, like I understand that, but I learn so much on TikTok. I don't really feel the same way about Instagram. There's a creator, her name is Rosie. She actually follows me on TikTok and I honestly was like a little starstruck when she did. I'm gonna link her down below because you guys should watch her videos. She is a mom of two, she has a newborn baby, but so I don't actually have like things that would relate to her normally, but she just talks about being like really overwhelmed in her house and like by like the cleaning and the managing managing of a house. And I do a lot of that for like for Max and I because I'm going with a more flexible job. And because generally I like to do that. But like grocery shopping, like cleaning up the fridge, I just almost always feel overwhelmed by the stuff I haven't done. Um, and like I'm working through those feelings of being like, I'm never gonna be like caught up. Like our house will never be perfectly clean or like perfectly, Put together in any way but she uses the fly lady cleaning method and i've heard of that but i've never really looked into it but her videos are making me really into it i actually sent them to emily because i was like i feel like you would like this and um she was like i love this lady and i was like yeah i get it so anyway i was thinking about that and then i also watched a youtube video about planning for 2020 like the 20 2022 oh my god I just said planning for 2020. Also, I look insane. Um, and it made me really want to get some calendars printed. Yesterday, when I was driving, I was kind of thinking about this. And I realized, I think I'm going to take the week between Christmas and New Year's off from like making content. I might take like a full social media break. I don't know. I'll probably I might post TikToks, just have them like pre-filmed. But I would just love to take a day or two to like lock myself in my office, like order lunch, order dinner, like make my day really easy, like do nothing else and just like get to work on like planning for the new year. I haven't done like any planning and I'd love to like be a little bit more ahead of the game. Also thinking about like YouTube ideas and like what I, like how much content I want to be able to put out in a day, like what that looks like and how much time that needs. Um, so that's something I'm like really interested in doing and then I also, would like to take a few days, probably like two, and like organize a lot of spaces in my house. Like I've been, ta I know I've been like talking about my linen closet and whatever, but there's like a bunch of spaces in my house that I'd love to just do, um, like my kitchen cabinets. Like I want to take. There's gonna be four days, Monday through Thursday, when Max is um, working after Christmas and before New Year's because he has Friday off. And so I think I'm gonna take those four days and do like two for my business and then two for the house and just get what I can get done. Like I obviously don't think I'll be able to do everything, but I think that it would be a good goal to just do, you know, what I can do and just kind of feel like we're starting our year fresh. Another thing I did recently is I got used this bin. This was actually in our linen closet. It's a plastic shoe bin actually. And I just put all of my daily stuff in it. So like skincare, makeup, um, and actually there was face, wa face wipes in here, but I just finished them last night and I just get it out every morning and then put it away because we have this teeny tiny little drawer to like between our sinks, but it's super tiny. It doesn't fit a lot of things like these big containers. And then I just slide it under my sink and my like stuff is away and I can keep my bathroom cleaner, but I don't actually have to like get everything out of the drawers every time. I wanted to show you guys the sweat set. It's, I just, I think it's cute. It's, it does definitely still look like sweats, but it's 
a really comfortable material. This is the 2X and these are big. Like I definitely could have even gone down a size and I feel like they would almost look better because they'd be like a little more tailored. The top, I like the size of. Um, it has this sort of like collar with a little drawstring. So anyway, I think it's cute. I'm excited to try the other one. Um, the pants are very high-waisted, so I can tuck this in if I want, but I'm gonna wear it for a little bit and see how it feels. I still have the tags on it in case I wanna return it, which I might return the pants for a smaller size. I think they had them. Stop, Max. What? Okay. Okay, so this day had taken a bit of an annoying turn, just doesn't even matter. But then we just got a knock on the door and my new computer is here. I ordered this before vlog was even started because I wanted to, my computer's like seven years old and I want to upgrade it before the end of the year so I can take out my taxes, blah, 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 blah. You could open it. Max wants to open it. Um, <laughs> you can open it. But I ordered it. I ordered the 15 inch MacBook Pro. It's like the new one. What? 14 inch? Okay, I don't know. Max ordered it basically. Um, yeah, I think it was 14 inch. Because what I have is a 17 inch, I think. Um, Anyway, it was supposed to be delivered tomorrow, but this is exciting. It'd be like so amazing. Keep your desk clean. What? I said keep your desk clean. Do you do that? <laughs> I don't tell them though. Oh my gosh. Ooh, it's like thicker. She a thick boy. This just feels like old school. It's not really that thick, but it's a little bit thicker than my computer is now. Hold on, you wanna film me? It's a nice box. Are you gonna keep the box? You always keep the box. Ooh. Oh my god, for a second I thought this was a CD slot. And I was like, dang, we really went back in time. Stupid. All right guys, I wanted to show you a few of the things I got from Target. First off being this set that I've been wearing all day. Um, here, I'm gonna lower you guys so you can see it. But, spoiler alert, I love it. I love this. It is this little like sweater set um i'm wearing both pieces in a 2x and i definitely think the pants run large um which is nice they're very comfortable i don't know if they're as like cute as they could be i feel like they kind of just look like sweatpants but they're very comfortable and i don't know if i can show you the material <sighs> it's kind of hard to tell but it is like a sweater material i also think the drawstrings kind of make it look more casual but i mean it's a sweat set it's gonna be kind of casual but i love it it's like not too hot because sometimes like a whole sweat set would be kind of hot but it's definitely warm and cozy i feel like it should be perfect for like lounging around but in a situation that you might want to be like a little bit more dressed up so like working from home or like i don't know if you're hanging with your in-laws or someone who like you just want to be in like an actual outfit this is perfect i don't know i feel like it all fits really well but i would maybe size down on the pants if you want them to be a little cuter i might um actually return these and get a 1x instead of a 2. Okay, this is really cute. This is just like one it's like a quarter zip sweatshirt. I have something from Amazon that's this exact sweater, but it's in brown. Um this one's a little bit of a chunkier knit, but it's very cute, very comfortable. I feel like it's kind of like a combo between a sweatshirt and a sweater. It has a drop shoulder. I think the color is nice. I like this cream color. I think this is a win. I don't think I'm going to keep it just cuz it has something so similar, but if you want the target version i would check your target or order online i think it's really cute <laughs> wait do i actually kind of like this dress it's actually kind of cute it's like this long maxi dress hits me right around the ankle i'm trying to back up far enough um has these sleeves is it a little like pilgrim lady yes but I don't hate it. This necktie they had tied really tight, which I would never tie it like that. I feel like it could even be looser because it does have like a V-neck under it. I don't, I kind of like it. Am I crazy? You guys tell me. Um, the sleeves are a tiny bit long. I think this is a 2X. Um, I kind of think it's cute for like a holiday thing. I don't know. It's not warm, like it's gonna be really chilly, but it's very comfortable. It's like stretchy in the waist. Like this would be kind of fun to like host Christmas dinner with because I would be so comfortable. Okay, this is the second sweater set. I actually like this more than I thought. These are the pants that are kind of like a wide leg crop. I actually think they're pretty cute. I don't know if I like them more or less. I feel like they're a little bit more, like less sweat panty like, but like 
They're still kind of sweat panty. This top I really like. I feel like it has kind of like marks on it. I don't really know why. Um, like the way it was folded or something, but I, I do think it's cute. It fits a little smaller than the other one. I think the neckline is really flattering and cute. It's very soft. I don't know if it's a slightly different material. I think the top is definitely worth it, even just to wear with jeans. The pants are definitely like, I don't know, they'd be really comfortable working though. Like just for some cozy at home pants. And like I said, these outfits I think would be really perfect for like Christmas morning opening like presents with like family or like, um, I don't know, just anything that's kind of like a loungy activity, but you still want to be like in clothes. I think this would be great. So I really like this set. I don't know, I might keep these. Okay, let's try the leather pants. All right, these are actually maybe a win. Like I'm shocked to say they're $25 or $24.99. These are the 3X, so they're a, my, like, a little bit larger than my normal size, but these actually fit pretty well and they're actually pretty comfortable. They make a little bit of noise when you move. Um, they're soft on the inside, so they actually feel very comfortable. They have like an elastic waistband. These are probably a tiny bit big, like around the top because like I said, they are a 3X. But like, I don't hate them. With like a longer sweater, actually, hold please. With this sweater, this like gigantic cardigan, I don't know, I kind of think they're cute. And they're definitely like pants. They're not leggings in that like, they're not see-through, they're totally covered. Are they probably the most flattering pants on earth? No, but for the leather look, for 25 bucks, that's pretty darn good. And this cardigan is so comfortable, it's so soft. It feels like I'm wearing a blanket right now. Like I might just keep this just to have it in my office and put it on when I'm working. I love it. I feel a little bit like Little Red Riding Hood though, but I don't know. I think it's cute. I wish the sweater was a little shorter because it's so big, but it's cute. I kind of like it. All right, guys, I hope you liked that Target haul. I feel like a lot of those pieces were really cute. I was surprised that I liked them all. Um, I am going to go. Oh, are you coming up to check on my computer? <laughs> Max started the transfer of my computer, but I haven't actually. Oh, it's gonna be, a while. it says eight hours. So I can't be on my computer for eight hours. Shoot, I did not think about that. Well, I guess I'm cutting, I'm cutting out of work early today. Okay, since my computer is still updating, it's been like an hour, honestly, I just was on my phone. I had to post a few things and then I literally was just scrolling my phone. Do you guys feel like when you have like, I don't even wanna talk about why I'm not having a great day. It's just some other random personal stuff. But when I'm like not in a good mood, I just scroll. Like I just like avoid my life and scroll. Anyway, the reason I came in here is because uh, this is our dumping ground. It's our guest bed. And I just put everything on here. Clothes I need to try on, clothes I need to return, clothes I need to put away. All of our Christmas gifts are sitting here. My Christmas gifts. Um, Christmas cards, just random stuff. So I've been avoiding this, but I'm at least, I'm just gonna make the, I'm, I'm just gonna do a, a little bit. I'm gonna put it into like piles of like return, Christmas gift and other stuff because something is better than nothing. So here we go. You know what I think today calls for? A cocktail. Um, I'm gonna try to make a version of what I made the other day, which was like a pomegranate margarita. Well, I don't know, is this gonna be good? I have these ginger beers. You don't think it'll be good? I don't know, I love, I, I was in the mood for a ginger beer, and then I saw this, and then I was like, oh, I should make this a cocktail with like the orange, and I also, I bought limes. So I was thinking limes, so like, what if it's a combo between a ginger, like a Moscow mule? I heard that it's called like a Mexican mule if you get a tequila, if you do a tequila mule. I don't really like vodka myself. And then if I add pomegranate, is that gonna be weird? I don't know, but let's try it because 
I, I'm sure I'll like it. I don't know whether other people would like it, but it's just me tonight, so who cares? Um, all right, let's do, we're gonna use the ginger beer as like a topper, I think. I'm gonna do, last time I did two things of pomegranate juice. Two ounces of pomegranate juice. I think I'm gonna do like two ounces of tequila and then like one ounce of, oh shoot, just spilled that all over myself, whatever. And then I'm gonna do half of a, like half an ounce of triple sec. I'm gonna do a lime and maybe some orange. I'm gonna squeeze the half of this orange. I feel like this is gonna be good. Why, why could it be bad? All right, we're gonna shake it with some ice. I'm not even gonna try this first. I'm just gonna hope for the best. This is what it looks like now. I'm gonna add the ginger beer. Let's try it. I feel like I need to stir it up first. It's in a straw. This is delicious. I am I like a bartender now or something? I don't know. Makes two decent cocktails and is like, I'm a bartender. No, but that's good. I'm gonna work on my paint by numbers because that feels like the nice relaxing thing I can do right now. <laughs> I don't know, but for some reason, I am just like really sore. Like I've done nothing. Honestly, I don't know, I think I've just like slept weird or something. My back and like my hip flexors and stuff, I don't know, I'm just like really sore. And then I was like, you know what I should do is take a nice, really hot bath before I get into bed, wash off this day. <laughs> Honestly, I didn't want to like make this video a downer and it, I, I still don't, but today was just kind of an annoying day. But I did get my computer and I made a good dinner and I honestly, it was kind of perfect that I had to quit work early because I think it just helped me be like, you know what, you just like detach, go do something else. Um, and then we watched some Ted Lasso and anyway, it was great. But now I'm gonna take a bath and I feel like I'm gonna wake up tomorrow in a much better mood. We have fun plans tomorrow, so I'm excited for that. I will see you guys then, bye.